Alright, here we go again, guys. Now that next custom story. Uh, followed by death, too. You escape an unimaginable horror and find yourself at the old Harmon's castle. You must find Francis Harmon, the castle owner, to find out what's after you. Well, let's do it. Let's do it, motherfucker. Uh, just kidding. I'm really hyper. I don't even know why, but I'm pumped. I'm pumped. Suck. Wow, this is really loud. Let me just turn this down just a bit. What? The Grey Curse. One of the most powerful phenomenons in the world. The power will live forever. The power to live forever, my bad. <coughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is sweet. Followed by death. Chapter two. This music is awesome. I already love it. You hear that it falling through. The fuck is going on right now? Oh, what the? Holy mother of god, this is intense! This is freaking intense! Oh! Holy crap, this is intense! I'm almost there! <laughs> that was intense. <laughs> Holy fuck, dude. Oh my god. Like, I started headbanging to the music and then all of a sudden water monster breaks down the door. <laughs> Good lord, that was intense. Did you throw me mine? Where? Oh, wait. No? Where? Um, story pulled by death continues. Hold on, guys. I'm op opening my fucking throat for all up for what? Almost there, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy. I have some fucking good fruit roll. What's going on here? Seriously, I have to give this guy props. That was the best fucking opener to a custom store ever. Good lord. Our task has not really been Ooh. irritating, but maybe a little bit frustrating. I want to maintain my authority, but it is becoming more difficult every moment. My servants, David, William and Henry, still do my bidding but no longer seem very eager to follow my orders. They are not rebelling against me outright, but it almost feels like a seed of mutiny has been planted among them. Are you kidding me? It doesn't matter. For so if you guys hear that in the background, that would be the oh-so-famous alarm bell. I must admit that I'm a very lucky man to have come across this book I found I mean, years ago. I had arranged oh, a whatever. with a man who had told me about some very interesting things. Books and tomes Books. concerning topics that people dare to whisper about. Things that frighten many, but could be very useful for an influential man like myself. Such a man would find those books very valuable indeed. So, I'm, I'm really liking this. 
fucking custom story now. Such, like, the most intense opening to a custom story ever. As sweet as hell. This almost feels like the real amnesia. Good lord. Shut up, old man. The hallways, the hallways have collapsed, so I need to go around. Well, shit. The books arrived in a nondescript chest. I anxiously opened the container, but I was quickly disappointed by the contents of it. I read some of the texts, and they were plain, bland and useless. It felt like almost everything in the chest were just a couple of dull paintings and peasant horror stories which seemed to serve no purpose. But after a couple of years, I reconsidered and decided to take a look once more at its contents. There was one book that caught my eye as soon as I saw it. The name of this mystic tome was simply The Rebirth, written by Andrew Daniels, a wise man who was considered one of the greatest wizards of his time. His words of wisdom, and likely the key to his powers, lie in this book. Miss? 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 <coughs> Give me that tender box. What I don't like in this custom story is the freaking amount of scary noises. It's almost, it's pretty much just like amnesia. Holy mother of God! Haha! <laughs> There's the derping noise again. Oh lord. Got the Bible on there. Good oh lord. I now possess the book <coughs> of the rebirth, and with it, I will soon possess its power. The book tells about the great curse, a ritual of the damned which grants people immortality by the cost of turning them into mindless beasts. According to the book, the Great Curse can be cheated in such a way that you gain the power to live forever without any negative side effects. I've been studying this book for a long time now, and I am certain that what the book says can be done. I have shown these texts to David, who has confirmed them to be accurate. Now the four of us venture into the dungeons of my castle, where we can perform the Great Curse in an alternative way. Cool story, bro. Oh, freaking tenor box. I wish you be, wish you be, wish you be, wish you be. God, girlfriend just scared me. She sneezed or made me jump. Holy mother of God. Good lord. What is going on? How much oil do I left? Not that much. I need oil. Give me up. Is this really necessary? Something in this feels really fishy to me. Of course it is necessary. 
Otherwise we wouldn't be here. You shouldn't be so paranoid all the time, William. You said that there's still a long way to go. How big is this castle anyway? I don't know. My ancestors built this castle a long time ago. Its deepest dungeons have not been seen by a living soul for some time now. Well, I have to say, this castle is really impressive considering that it was built so long ago. Yes, I also find this castle very impressive indeed. Don't you think so too, Henry? Yes, my lord. Good! We need to use the old elevator to reach the lowest levels of this castle. This way. So, we're gonna go use an elevator, I guess? Let's see what in... Yep! Yeah! Yeah! Nothing. I want that epic intro to come back. I just like... I feel like... Oh god, I just want to headbang again. Oh lord, I feel so slow for some reason on this. So I must move on! Each word on to the living room. I'm gonna go to the living room. The book that Francis held had some interesting carvings on it. On the front, Francis had it hidden. It's well hidden. Had it well hidden. Hidden, Francis had it. Okay, that's enough of that. Good lord. What going on here, Shaka? What is it? I should check out the living room for some useful equipment I may find. No shit, Shaka. That's what I was going to do. Ah, oh, close the door. You think you're cool because you're not breaking? What the shit? There we go, good lord! For a second there I thought that wasn't gonna break. What's that? Oh, it's not an atom. Oh! Yeah! I probably should have explored the other rooms a little more. Let's go do that. Whole lot of nothing. Why is there always nothing in this freaking butter? The door of the office must be locked. I must find a key to get open it. Key in here? Give me that chemistry pop. I don't like doing chemistry, but I guess we'll have to do it anyways. Reminder for David. My memory is getting rather disconscious again. I can't remember things. Back at home too well anymore. Well, I'll return. I'll have to tell my brother. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. God dang, I a good brother. Now I want to be friends with him again. I got the pressure of my best starting to burn me once again. Uh, 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 dot dot dot. Good lord. Frickin' god dang it. Hmm. Is there anything else in this room? I'll take that as a no. I guess there isn't. So let's go jump out the window again. Yay! We did it, Mr. Chair! We did it! Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Chair. My nose itches. Lie. Good 
Do you really think it's true? Can we somehow carry out the ritual of the Great Curse? I think with Francis on our side, we'll figure out something. Francis. 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 I don't trust him. It feels like he's not the same man I once knew. Francis. Give me that tender box. The safe in the wall is locked. It must be remote. Where must it be watch? Because tonight we're going hard, 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 hard. Just like we're superstars, stars, 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 stars. Did you break a million? We are who we are. Tonight we're acting like we're dumb, 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 dumb. DJ, turn it up, 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 up. DJ, turn it up, 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 up. Okay, that's enough, Kesha. I'm gonna get copyright infringement on my profile at this rate. Can I break this window too? I like breaking windows. In the boxes. Oh, I'm supposed to be looking for a switch. Mr. Chair, how about you adventure to the top of the bookshelf? William Suspicions. Being in this company of Francis has always been beneficial, but he seems too eager in this place as of late. I can't help but think he'll lead us to our deaths. Henry has always been a loyal, bad. <coughs> I'm my voice to do this. Very loyal to Francis and won't question his orders. I don't understand his motives. Henry never even turned his eyes toward us to us. Even says the word unless Francis is around. I think he's hiding something, Henry and Francis both. But as for me and David, we'll stop those two if they try to double fucking cross us. Nick. No, okay, I'm not racist. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, chill out. Good lord. Good fucking lord. This is a good campaign to play if you're hyper. So I gotta find a switch in here, I guess. Wait a minute, is that... There's some sort of secret mechanism regulating to these books in the library. Oh, so that means I'm gonna have to find more. It's clearly... Yep, here it is. Found it. Another fake book. Should keep looking for more. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. What the fuck? God damn it. So I need to look for these motherfucking books. I mean, oh, here's one. The books are pouring. Books are going right through it. It seems that we're not. Oh, okay, here we go. <clears throat> I 
Let's try this out. Um, one, two, three. All right. <clears throat> Let's go. You first. My neck is at you. Um, you second. And you, I see you over there. Fucking go, wait for me to come over there and grab you. Oh yeah. You third. Yeah! I did it. 